Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So this video is I feel like it's a different video. I've ne never done a like experience with me type of video like bring you guys along with me. But I I don't know. I want to bring you guys along with me in case you guys are curious and want to know more about it or you know see my experience with it. But anyways, let me tell you guys what it's about. So, my package came in the mail and let me just show you guys what it is since i'm looking at it so this is what it is and it's oh it's mad big as you guys can see it's smile direct so i show you guys what's inside it just came in the mail like maybe an hour ago and i'm gonna put them in for the first time today backstory of why i want to do smile direct i always since probably i want to say like fifth grade since i was like 10 maybe i always wanted the braces I felt like I didn't like my teeth. I also liked the braces. Like, I don't know. I was like that weird kid that thought braces were so cool. But I also had gaps in my teeth. I mean, I still do have gaps. I feel like they were probably a little bit bigger when I was a kid. But I remember asking for braces. Like, I want the braces so bad. And I went to get, like, a consultation for braces. And they said it wasn't covered by my insurance, I guess, because it wasn't a necessity. Like, it wasn't something that I needed which I was like you don't see these gaps in my mouth I need it but anyways it wasn't a necessity and I still wanted you know to get braces and then it kind of like grew up and I forgot about it and like my teeth didn't really bother me so much like I don't smile with my teeth that's one thing I don't do I don't smile like like nope I don't know, like, I've been so insecure about my teeth since I was little that, like, I just... Smiling with my teeth is not an option. It's something that I, I... It, like, tore me apart. Like, it was just, like, my teeth. Oh, my God, my teeth. I kind of just got over it. I, just one thing I knew for sure was I was not smiling with my teeth. That's it. Then I got over it, whatever. Then as of recently, like, maybe, like, a month or two ago, I don't know what it was. But you know when you notice one thing and then you just can't, like, not see it anymore so i was editing my video and i was doing a lot of talking like i'm doing now i just kept looking at my teeth like i don't know what happened but like now i'll be looking at everybody's teeth when i'm when i'm looking at videos so now that i'm editing my video i'm just looking at my teeth and i'm doing all this talking and i'm just like girl no long story short i decided to to start small direct and i know there's a bunch of mixed reviews about it and it's good it works for some people it doesn't blah 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 whatever i just came to the conclusion that anything you do in life it's not going to be a hundred percent perfect i guess like a hundred percent great reviews from like everybody like somebody's always going to have an issue with something that's just the fact like somebody's always gonna have an issue with something and it might not have worked for this person but it worked for this person like everybody's different whatever the case is be nice you know keep your negative comments to yourself we're gonna try i'm gonna try this i personally don't think that my teeth i'm gonna show you guys my teeth you know before i put the aligners on but i personally don't think that my teeth are terrible to the point where i should have gone to a dentist i feel like if i had like a big a really big gap or like overcrowding in my teeth or like something like that where i feel like a dentist should watch over i would have totally you know try to gone try to go through the dentist i just feel like i have these baby gaps that a lot of people don't even notice like there's sometimes where people are like you don't even need braces like what are you doing that you don't notice but you notice about yourself so i feel like it's first of all invisalign and braces are really expensive like super duper expensive with insurance as well too so i just feel like i'm gonna try this out because i like i said my gaps aren't t too major so i feel like i should be fine you know anyways so a month ago i went in and i did like the whole 3d scan they do send you a molding that you can do at home but and i was thinking of doing that because i don't have a small direct where i live there used to be one here and i think since with covid or whatever it kind of got closed down i was gonna do the molding but I, I was also like what if i don't do the molding right what if i mess up on the molding what if i'm not getting all my teeth so i was just like no and i went to brooklyn kind of by the barclay center and i did like the whole 3d scan and it was great because you got to talk to somebody and if you guys go there i 
don't know the exact address let me see if i have it here this is this I don't think I have the exact address, but it's literally like by the Barclays Center over there. So if you were around that area or close to it, that's where I went. And I, the girl that helped me, her name was Genesis. She was so nice, super sweet. Like she was easy to talk to. Like if you go, go see Genesis and tell her I sent you. So she did the whole 3D scan. I was able to see what my teeth were going to look like. And, you know, at the end of this, she explained, she asked me if I had any questions. Super fun, super comfortable, and super fast. Like, the appointment was literally 30 minutes. Not that much of your time. I did record. I tried to record a little bit of that process. So I'll put what I have. It's not the best angle that I took it at, but I'll put what I have. <laughs> scans in and they got back to me my plan I'm on a four month plan so basically with Smile Direct it's like four to six months depending on your teeth you can have them for six months you five months mine's is four month plan it shows you where your teeth are supposed to look like at the end and everything in this box so all your aligners come in this box that you're supposed to wear throughout the four months there's no like waiting for more to come in they're all in here let me just show you guys what is in this box so this right here i got the day that i went in to do my whole 3d scan so this is a whitening Ooh, i have like butterfingers today this is like a whitening to whiten your teeth i'm gonna do that before i put the aligners in then this is like the thing to stretch your mouth like that game i forgot the game is called but this is it i get to take pictures of your teeth and the progress and then I have these whitening brush on gels. This one came, this one she gave to me when I went in for the 3D. So now I have two more. This is a lip balm. This is the case that we keep the aligners in when we have to take them off. And it comes with a little mirror in the back. Oh, right here. So I think that's super cute. It also comes with a file for any sharpness that you feel. You can, I guess, file it down. This is like a pick if you need help to take them off. And these, they call movements, which are basically mints that help um, your aligners go in place. So I guess if you're having a hard time, you can just chew on one of these. And, oh, I have another lip balm from when I went. And then also these are where my liners are so basically i will pull them out by when it's time so this is a liner one i have to wear it for one week 22 hours a day and then when i'm done i will just grab the next one so i don't know why i'm so nervous i'm about to put them on I already brushed my teeth and I flossed and did all that fun stuff but I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna lighten them before I go ahead and put the aligners on it says brush your teeth first then remove the cap to your pen slowly twist the bottom of the pen until you see a droplet of gel form on the brush okay 
let's do that. I'm just gonna use this baby one, I guess. Or are these the same? thousand years later I'm very confused Oop. okay so I'm back and we went in the teeth By the way, this is a before of my teeth. See? Got little gaps going on. Oh, and I don't know if I mentioned, but little whitening mouthpiece comes with adapters and you can literally just plug it into your phone. Like, very convenient. This is the iPhone adapter, but it does come with, like, I guess, the Android one and, like, some other one. So we did that. My lips look so crusted and busted. It does say, your teeth will continue to whiten after the gel absorbs. Please don't rinse, eat, or drink for 20 minutes after you're done. Okay. I'm just gonna start. So, I guess it's time to put the aligners. I don't know why I'm like a little nervous. I feel like it might hurt. Time to put the aligners in. So, they come in this little baggie that I showed you guys. Yeah, these are aligner one. Wear them for one week. So, let's do it. I was about to say, how do I know what's top and bottom? But obviously, this must be the top. Well, I think they're in. Oh my god, I feel like I have a little gag reflex right now. Mm, I feel like I'm having like a moment right now. So we're gonna go ahead and put the bottom ones on. I feel like the top ones are pretty secure. Let's put on the bottom ones. I hope these bottom ones fit me. Looks like they cut off a little bit of the back. I have no idea. Okay, so it feels pretty tight. Um Am I not supposed to like bite down on my mouth? Like go like this? So I think I have them on right. This is what it looks like. I am thinking of chewing on one of these movements because this I guess to make sure that they on since this is my first time I'm not really sure. So it says, put a mitt in your mouth, softly chew on the mitt to guide your aligners into place. Do not chomp on it, just softly chew. Once your aligners are in the position, use the mitt as use the mitt as a mitt because it's a mitt. That's literally what it says. Use the mitt as a mitt because it's a mitt. Okay, now direct you little sassy. Not me having like a little lisp happening here. Okay, this is what the mitt looks like. Softly two on the mid to guide your aligners into place. As I chew, I do feel it like tightening up on the aligners. I guess they're in, guys. I'm probably just not used to it, but I'm about to put this lip balm on because my lips are looking mad dry. I was told to download the app. By the way, before I get into that, because you guys are probably like, does it hurt? Like, what's going on? No, it doesn't hurt at all. Obviously, it feels a little weird. Like, just weird, because you got, like, I've never had any night guards or braces or any of that in my mouth, so this just feels a little weird but i was watching tiktoks and i kept like this guy he would take an advil every time he was going to put them in his mouth i guess to help with the pain it doesn't hurt but i feel like everybody's mouth and teeth are different like if you had overcrowding maybe it will hurt more to put this in your mouth 
I just had like many little gaps here and there as you guys saw in the before they don't hurt they literally just feel like I have um, a guard or something like in my mouth pain tolerance so far so good back to the app so the app I guess is you're supposed to like say that you started it and it could be like a reminder to tell you when you have to switch it out I received my aligners this is what the app looks like let's get this party started unpack that bur burple 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 box and begin your treatment plan by checking in your first aligners check in aligners whether today is your first day or you've already started treatment will help you stay on top of your small journey so it has two options here and it says I'm starting treatment today or if I've started treatment so I'm starting treatment today aligner one today's date confirm all of your aligners are numbered and arranged in order inside your box only take out one pack of aligners at a time until it's time to switch this is a liner and dental hygiene tip. Brush your teeth after eating and before popping your liners back in. Clean liners every day to keep them and your breath fresh. That it says that the guy that I saw on TikTok had aligner cleaners and I don't have aligner cleaners. So I'm not sure what are we supposed to do here. Anyways, I'll figure that out in a second. But through clear liners that vis invisible, you'll still be able to feel them because they're working hard to straighten your smile. Remember, your liner should cover a bit of your gum line. Okay. Fit snugly against your teeth. They do. Touch your back molars. They do. What to expect on your smile journey? How long do I need to wear my smile direct liners each day? To get your ideal smile, wear your custom aligners all day and night, except for when eating, drinking, brushing, or flossing. Okay. Is this going to make me skinny? Because I'm going to have to take them out every time I eat. I might just starve myself. I'm kidding, guys. Your aligners are all checked in. We'll let the doctor know that you've started treatment. All set. Here's my little dashboard, I guess. So it says, next aligner, switch. My treatment days, I have 112 days left, and I should be having a new smile by September 24th of this year. I sound so funny with this on. This says how to clean your aligners. You can use any cleaning tablets, but we recommend our universal cleaning tablets. Soap and water. Squeeze a bit of gentle liquid soap onto a cup of warm but not hot water. So studs form, soak your liners in soapy water for 20 to 30 minutes and then rinse them clean. That's it for that little app. I mean, there's a lot of information that if you want to keep searching, you can. Right now, they don't hurt. Like, I have something in my mouth, which is obvious. I already, like, ate the mint. So, I'm assuming everything's in there. I'm just thinking of, like, little things here and there. Like, I'm going to have to carry on with a toothbrush because <laughs> we're supposed to brush our mouth brush our teeth every time we eat and put it back in so if i'm going out to eat i have to carry with a toothbrush or something i guess i'm gonna have to get a travel toothbrush but yeah i'm excited to see where this journey is gonna take me like i said there's always good and bad reviews about everything i wanted to try this out and i'm happy that i went with it because it will make me feel better about my teeth maybe i'll smile more with my teeth and when i'm editing videos i won't feel like Every time I'm talking legit, guys, I'm always like, stop talking. Look at that gap. Stop talking. This is something that I wanted to do for myself, and I honestly wanted to do it for so long. So I did it, and I'm taking you guys along with me, because if you guys are thinking about it, you know, dental work and Invisalign and braces and all that stuff is really expensive. I mean, if you really, really need to do it like that, I nonetheless go to a dentist, but if this is something that's gonna help me and it has a cheaper alternative a cheaper alternative then why not thank you guys for watching this video i hope you guys enjoyed and i hope you guys are excited to come with me on this journey too to see where we can take these teeth if you guys are interested in seeing more or have any questions just leave leave them down below i'm also thinking about like showing it on my tiktok i don't know but I'll leave my TikTok down below. You guys can DM me on Instagram. Leave it on the comments. Whatever makes you feel better. And I'll catch you guys in my next video. Bye.